spit some wisdom real quick to these love it to some of the listeners because i i try and literally when i do a show uh, i try and make it super entertaining for an adult but i also try and talk to my 14 15 and 16 year old self when i was lost right? all right let's go um i wasn't the best all the time I, I i wasn't i wasn't the most athletic i wasn't the fastest um i was undersized but if you're out there and you want to be something and you want to do something, if you stay on the path and you just stay focused, you show up every day on time and ready to work, the people around you are going to fall off the path for whatever reason. It doesn't matter. But they're going to start jumping off. And eventually my goal when I was in the league, when I was with the Eagles, is I wanted to be the oldest player on the team. And people thought that was that, well, that, that's random. Yeah, but if I'm the oldest player on the team, then I gave myself so many opportunities to have success in what I love to do. Oh, you want to win a Super Bowl? Great. Well, what if I won one the next year and then I got cut and never played again? So if I was the oldest guy on the team, I'm good to go. Now, to do that, you want to surround yourself with people that lift you up. But here's the deal. You also want to become a teammate that your team would hate to lose and every opponent fears. And I believe that. And how you do that is you basically be kind to one another, work hard, make yourself so valuable, not just on the field, but in the locker room and to sponsors and to anything in your business. Be somebody that people want to be around. And the next thing you know, guys like Andy Reid who have some pull are going to keep you around. Because you do your job, you get it done, you show up, they don't have to worry about you, you hold yourself accountable, so therefore they don't have to hold you accountable. And they know that they would rather ride and die with you than maybe somebody that was athletically better than you or faster than you.